Hey, so I'm going to talk a little bit about the differences between fast glass and slow glass that I sell in my store. Right here we have a piece, or a set rather, of fast glass. And you can see right away that the top piece is very curved. And what this does is it allows you to get a lot of grip and a lot of good control over the plate. They make very good lead plates, uh, or things where you need tricky movements. And both of these will spin, as you can see. Uh, I should also mention that the fast set has a much flatter bottom plate, while the slow set, which we're getting to now, has a much more curved bottom plate. Uh, however, the slow set, as you can see here, has a much flatter top plate. Uh, and what this does is allows for a nice big broad squish over all the liquids that you might have there. It is a bit of a tighter fit as you can see. Uh, it doesn't leave as much room for control as the fast plate. Uh, so it takes a bit of finesse, a little bit of practice, but it's a great plate. So there you go. Those are the pros and cons of each of the plates. Uh, yeah, check them out. So here's the fast plate in action. Uh, as you can see, the movements are really tricky. Uh, quite fast and there's a lot of like really cool little uh, finessing things that you can do with it. Uh, this case, the I do honestly wish that the color had came out a bit better. I blew the plate here, literally put like too much blue into it. So it's looking like almost black. Uh, but still you can see the, the motion and the range of uh, things that are possible with it. Now let's take a look at the slow plate. Much different range of motion happening right here. You can see it's, uh, it's just oozing. It's moving very slowly. Um, I do have a mineral oil heavy mixture in here, plus a uh, lot more alcohol. Uh, not going to lie, these plates aren't the best, but they were filmed right after I did the glass showcase that you saw a second ago. And I wanted to maintain the integrity throughout the video. So, you know, what showed up right after is what I'm showing. So you can see actually in action the slow plate I showed you and the fast plate. And finally, here are them together, both overhead projectors projected. Uh, and you can see, you can see the uh, the blue and red fast plate bouncing and going crazy. Uh, and you can see this nice cool yellow pattern that's created by the slow plate uh, just chilling.